hello. I have to keep this hood up and keep my hair hidden because it's disgusting. But not for long because I'm going to the hairdressers today. I think I'm going to film a day in the life. It's a Saturday, but every day is a Saturday to me because I'm not working. Mmm. Also, I got a new dressing gown. I will never tell Udi no to sending me a dressing gown because I flip and love them. Okay, I should probably give you a bit of an update because I actually was filming another vlog. Like, whenever I come home from holidays, I started filming another, like, week in the life and... Then I soon realised that being, being unemployed, well being on my holidays, I'm not unemployed, I'm on my holidays, is so boring, like I was not doing anything all day and I was like there's literally nothing going on in this vlog, I was getting like kitted up to go out and like garden, to like pull out the weeds and I was like nobody cares about this, like nobody cares that I'm doing this here, so I'm not uploading that there and obviously like I said my holiday vlog, I am finished for the summer, obviously it's amazing getting these holidays but one, I feel like I literally have seasonal depression in summer because it's rained every day. And also, like, everyone else is working still. Why can't everyone get school holidays? Because nobody's, like, free. Yeah, I've just been doing wee things here and there to pass my days by. But today I finally have something exciting happening because I'm getting my hair done. I was in with Lauren yesterday and she was all, oh, you're going to sit in the hairdressers on a Saturday. I was like, Lauren... Like I just said, every day is a Saturday. This makes no difference to me. Um, and I'm gonna get my hair done and then me and Paul are going out for dinner. Guess where we're going? Uh, Ume. We go to Ume at least once a month. My mommy was like, do you wanna take Ruby up to gymnastics this morning? And I was like, uh. I was like, no. Also so excited because I was gonna say to Chloe, do my hair for tonight so I don't have to do it. I kinda didn't register that I won't have to do my hair later. Okay, I need to get dressed. Let's pick a wee outfit. Let me show you my drawers. They're so organized now. Um, apart from these. Because I don't have any more room. Uh, I rolled up all my jeans and stuff and then while I was on holidays my mum hung up all of my, my wee tops like vest tops and stuff but I think I'm gonna have to put them back on hangers so I can put them trousers in there and then I'll also put like some hoodies in here and like tracksuits like things that I would reach for every day and then in here we've got gym stuff and this one we have well this is kind of a bit random denim shorts and then we have like some matching sets and stuff in here. I mean, I think that's tidy. For me, that is tidy. Okay, I just put on this top and black jeans. I think I might roll the top or something because it's kind of an awkward length, but... But anyway, I wanted to wear something plain and black on the bottoms because I want to use my new bag. Teddy Blake sent me another bag and they have kindly offered to sponsor this video. I've already been using the bag flat out, but I put it back in here to show how like nice it is. Big, nice box, so luxurious and then inside it comes in like bubble wrap and stuff but then you also get this way nice bag this is mine oh i love it so much it's so me I worked with teddy blake i think two years ago and they sent me my wee orange bag which i literally wear all the time when i say that bag that orange bag looks brand new to this day like it is just in the best quality ever and I cannot look after my things so I don't know how that is. Hold on, I need to put lip liner on. Okay, much better. Quality of these bags is so good and yes, they are more on the expensive side. No, I didn't pay for this but I can justify paying for expensive things if I think the quality is worth it and I'm gonna get the wear out of it and I know from my orange bag that like, like the quality is worth it. It's Italian leather. I have no idea what that means but I think it's good because it feels great. The reason that I chose this style is like they have so many different styles of bags but I I wanted one that I could literally just have for like everyday use that was the perfect size. I didn't want like a big bag, you know, like a mum bag, but I just wanted one that was bigger than what I would usually have on my shoulder and I just feel like it's perfect everyday bag. Look how cute it is. Is that not the most like perfect everyday bag you've ever seen? I also need a bag to be on my shoulder. I don't like carrying my bags. I will leave the link down below if you just want to go and have a look for a nice bag. Anyway, I'm gonna pack my bag. I actually never bring like what's in my bag normally is literally like a lip liner and a lip, lip gloss. Let's throw them in first. I'm also gonna take my purse. I never take my purse anywhere. Like I just always pay on my phone. I never have a bank card and which means I never have like change. I think there's so much change in here. But I'm gonna get used to carrying my purse around again. I also lost my license. So so actually it's kind of very pointless me carrying around my purse because I don't even have a license in it. What else do I need? Okay, I'm ready to go. Don't look at my room. I'm actually wearing these um, lip flops. I got them for holidays and they didn't arrive in time. They're from Pull and Bear. So I'm just like literally getting my wear out of them now. And I kind of love it. I feel like a bit like a, I don't know, would you say they're like Platy's mom vibes? If I had to pick like an everyday outfit, this would be it. These like rectangle sunglasses, a black bag, and just like a nice sweet top and jeans. Like this is what I would live in for the rest of my life. I look like I'm going to a wedding. 
I need my outfit and my hair and all on. Chloe's just cleaning in my ear now. <laughs> yeah, uh, okay, hair is done. It looks a little crazy. I'm actually gonna get my car washed right now, which is something I've been meaning to do for about nine months. I really hope there's not a queue. Is there, oh, there's no queue, great. I'm definitely gonna look in and be like, why is this wee girl recording? Right, I got loads of pound coins. This is so awkward. Oh, it's the bit where they open the doors. <laughs> I forgot that was coming. Seven pound for a Fiat 500. Is that good? I don't know if that's good or not. Maybe that is good, but at least I have a clean car now. Right, I just took my makeup off. I'm gonna start getting ready now. I'm not going to vlog because I want to film a TikTok, get ready with me. I can see my wee cousin. My neighbors running up out of my house. They're all gonna be up here in a minute, but yeah, I need to get ready. I've got an hour before I need to leave, so ready to go. I was gonna clip some of these like bits of hair up here, but I honestly do need to leave like right now, but I was thinking, like, should I clip it up so it's just like a wee bit shorter? If I do, I'm gonna do that now, but- But this is my outfit. It's a little backless moment. That's why I wanted my hair up. And then I do have on these gold heels. Like, I am fancy for dinner. Like, I am really fancy right now, but I've left the house in like a week. Also, the tan on my shoulders is peeling, which is just really sad. Okay, now I don't know what to call this vlog because it's a few days later. I can't say a day in life or I can't say a weekend vlog. I don't know why I get bothered by these things. Like, what the vlog is going to be called. Anyway, I'm going to meet my friend for coffee. Outfit of the day. I'm raging because I ordered Levi black jeans and and they're too long. And I really want to wear them today because I just want, like, just want, like, black straight leg jeans. Ones that don't go, like, wide at the bottom. This is basically the same outfit as I wore the other day. Also, I just don't know whether I should just put my trainers on because it is not warm and the shoes could look kind of weird. And she wedges her fingers on like this here. Go on, say what you just said there now. Why do you want me to move out? Why do you want me to move? <laughs> she wants me to move out because I'm not moving out. New caramel syrup. I made my mom and daddy get these in Tesco. I got my shaving gel and my dry shampoo. Now I'm going to make a coffee and then I'm getting ready to go see barbie tonight i was saying to ellie there like i don't i don't have anything pink to wear that's appropriate to wear to the cinema like all my pink things is like going out stuff like wee tops and skirts and she i was like i don't think i'm gonna be able to wear pink and she was like you need to wear pink she was like don't be a hater you need to wear pink and i was all you know what you're right if i don't wear pink it's giving off like not a girl's girl do you know what i mean like if i don't wear pink so I'll, i'm sure i'll find something and i said to paul he has to wear his pink polo and he was like no it's me pink ralph Lauren polo it's supposed to be me mama you're supposed to arrange mommy for us to go and you know what you didn't i arranged you arranged you, you didn't arrange please. anything and i've waited so long to go and see it so i'm nobody's second choice kidding <laughs> you weren't even my first you weren't even my second Second choice. I am no second. <laughs> you aren't even second to me. Okay, I just quickly changed. This is what I'm wearing. And I'm just gonna leave it at this. I think I'm gonna go now because we might have a few drinks and play a game of bowls, which I am flipping terrible at. I haven't ate anything apart from my soup today at lunch. Honestly, like, see, whenever I'm off work and I'm not like doing anything, that is one thing I'm so bad for is just not eating meals. But anyway, that's a problem for tomorrow. Okay, I don't even know what you've seen last. I'm probably only gonna vlog today and then I'll end this vlog. I'm about to leave and go into Tesco to get some like food. Cause I just like need to sort my routine out. Like I need to start like eating breakfast and lunch and dinner at like normal times and like not. I just need to sort the routine out. Like I can't do this here like, having like two iced coffees till five o'clock and then having dinner. I am actually worried that my body is gonna like shut down. I'm sorting my shit out today. I'm gonna tidy my room. I have to send a few emails. I have to do an invoice. I'm gonna start to edit, the, edit this video. Like I am getting my life together. Also, this is what I look like. It doesn't scream getting my life together, but it screams comfort. And that's all I care about. Okay, I'm gonna make some avocado on toast. This is actually like my latest obsession. Also, these avocados are literally perfect. I'm gonna mush it up. Then I'm gonna add some salt, some garlic granules, and then a wee bit of lemon juice. I actually thought this was lime juice when I've been using it. 
Then we're gonna mash it all together again. I think I'm gonna have three bits of sourdough bread because it's quite small. I don't really buy sourdough bread that often because I feel like it's just like, it's not big and I feel like a lot of it goes to waste and you have to eat it within the first few days of getting it, but it just tastes so much nicer on this than it does on normal bread. I'm determined to become a really clean and tidy person. Like I'm just gonna clean up now while that's getting ready. I'm actually here on my own as well for a few days because my mom and daddy are in England. So I need to keep everything tidy. Okay, I put butter on before my avocado. I don't know if people do that or not, but I just feel like butter, I just feel like it's nicer. And then a wee bit of honey. I actually bought, I bought this honey today and I didn't realize we had some. I love how I'm showing you the most basic recipe ever. Like everybody eats this here. I'm like the last person to jump on the bandwagon. But now that I'm on it, I understand the hype. Okay, I'm fed and watered. Right, now I'm gonna make a list. One of my favorite things to do, of all the things that I need to do today. I've been really bad at writing in my diary. Oh, my diary's actually finished. It only goes up to August. That's right, this is an academic diary. I've got loads of room in the notes section. So first things first, I'm going to, um, I cannot be bothered to do anything. Right, I need to film stories. I need to film three stories for a brand. I need to film a TikTok or a jewellery place. Lie to my emails. Replying to emails is the thing that I actually put off the longest, but it takes me no time at all. Because I say this all the time, it's not like I'm flooded with emails that I can't keep up with them. There's literally, I think, like four that I need to reply to, but I don't know why I always hate doing it. It's because it requires, like, I have to think it requires brain power because I have to process what they're saying and then, but it literally takes no time at all. And then I'm gonna edit this vlog. I need to sort the washing. Okay, actually I actually think that's everything. We can add to it. Right, I'm gonna get started on one right now. I'm gonna film my stories. They're my stories for Udi, dressing gown that I was wearing. I think before I do anything, I actually might do like an ice bowl on my face, like stick my face into a bowl of ice because I'm not feeling myself. <laughs> I went into my nana's for dinner and then I just came out and showered. I did nearly everything. I still have to edit this video, which I am going to sit down and do now because Paul's coming to stay and he is only leaving now, so he's going to be a good half an hour. So I could get, I've already started it, I could get a good chunk of it done. My house is actually pretty tidy. This is only the first day really of me staying on my own, second day. And I'm just acting like I live on my own all the time. I'm also a wee bit peckish because I did have my dinner ages ago. I might make some toast. That's something I never do. I never make like toast in the evenings as a snack. Right, okay. I'm gonna sit and finish editing this and then me and Paul are gonna chill. That's the end of this vlog. Maybe I'll just start another one again. Maybe I'll do a weekend vlog. My friend's having a graduation party. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.